National Minority Mental Health Awareness Month is observed every July to cast a light on the unique struggles minority communities face with mental health issues. Our Victoria Bailey spent the day finding out just how important having the tough conversation really is. July is Minority Mental Health Awareness Month. So this month is particularly designed to bring awareness and to acknowledge um, issues concerning mental health and substance use disorders that lies within minority communities. Sharika Jefferson is the Noxabee County Administrator. She says racial minority groups usually experience higher levels of anxiety, depression, suicidal tendencies, and post-traumatic stress disorder. When it comes to um, the black communities, um, for some particular reason, there's a cultural stigma there um, that mental illness or mental health is a problem or that we should be able to endure those things. Um, there have been several years of trauma that has caused us to not be able to overcome those things. Um, fortunately, we have overcome many things, but there is still that psychological point or an aspect that has not been addressed that we must always find time to address. People sometimes find the courage and comfort to discuss their feelings in unlikely spaces. Bobby Jordan's been a barber in the friendly city for more than 20 years. Normal wild clients come in, they want to talk about what they're going through, and they want to express how they feel, so it's a good place to uh, release pressure. He says since he set up shop, important life topics have been up for discussion. Most people are feeling confused, hopeless, and they wonder what's going on because we're in a different world. Well, I tell you what, years ago they used to call the barbershop the Black Man Country Club because he feel like he could be free to say what he wants to say without any judge. So the barber is part of the family, so they're going to express to the barber how they feel. Jefferson says getting the conversation started is key for all groups and locating mental health services. Every community should have a community mental health center. We are not our illnesses. Um, we have to be comfortable with talking about how mental health challenges have impact every single person on this earth. Telling your story for WCBI News, I'm Victoria Bailey. For more information on mental health services in your area, visit communitycounselingservices.com.